Info psychology is the science which studies the evolution of the nervous system from its terrestrial mechanical collective stages to its post-terrestrial quantum cyber stages. At the same time, the psychology of the industrial age was becoming a priestly techno-religion. The chemical, physical, information, and biological sciences were quietly producing theories, facts, and techniques which have profound implications for the changing of human nature. The psychologies of the industrial age, while claiming to measure thinking, consciousness, and behavior, for the most part study the adjustment and maladjustment of human beings to social rituals and culturally defined constraint systems. Appearing at a time when feudal theology was losing its meaning for the growing class of semi-educated mechanical psychology provided a comforting rationale for domestication, a soothing pseudo-scientific language for supporting the values of the factory culture. Industrial psychology, in spite of enormous state-supported bureaucracies and its priesthood mystique, produced no verifiable theories for explaining human behavior nor any methods for solving the classic problems of human society crime, war, conflict, alienation, prejudice, stupidity, boredom, aggression, unhappiness, and philosophic ignorance about the meaning of life. At the same time, the psychology of the industrial age was becoming a priestly techno-religion. The chemical, physical, information, and biological sciences were quietly producing theories, facts, and techniques which have profound implications for the changing of human nature. Neurology locates the source of consciousness, memory, learning, and behavior in the nervous system a 100 billion cell biocomputer for which the body is transportational robot. Clearly, if we wish to understand and improve our mental, emotional, and behavior functions, the locus of investigation is the nervous system. The person who can dial and tune the receptive, integrative, transmitting circuits of the nervous system is not just more intelligent, but can be said to operate at a higher and more complex level of evolution. Pre-cyber humans maintain a rigid taboo about discussing or tampering with their nervous systems, a phobia which is based on a primitive fear of the unknown and a superstitious reluctance to learn how to know. It is now evident that the nervous system is an incredibly powerful instrument for conscious evolution which can be understood and employed for genetic tasks by those who accept the pilot responsibility. Ethology, which studies animal behavior in the natural and experimental setting, has demonstrated the robot instinctual nature of neural discrimination and the role of imprinting and determining when and towards what animal behavior is initiated. Industrial psychologists have failed to apply the findings of ethology to the human situation. The fact that most human emotional, mental, sexual, and ethical behavior is based on accidental imprinting of the nervous system during critical or sensitive periods of development is unsettling to mechanical age cultures. If individuals learn how they were imprinted, they can learn how to re-imprint or reprogram their brains. Neurochemistry has recently discovered that neurotransmitter chemicals which facilitate or inhibit nerve impulses and synaptic connections determine consciousness, emotion, memory, learning, and behavior. Psychopharmacology at the same time has discovered botanical and synthetic psychoactive agents which facilitate or inhibit states of consciousness, accelerate or dampen mental function, and permit cyber persons to reprogram.